Welcome, this is the IM2. This is for Delta Math here. I will be covering the solution for the Delta Math increasing versus posit positive graphic. So here we have the function f of x is graphed below. What is true about the graph on the interval from the point f to point g? So if we look at this, we're going from point f to point g and we're gonna talk about it. All right, so I have this in paint. Let's zoom in to f and g. So at f and g, we saw that it is curving up. So that means it is going this way. It's going up. So we would say that it is um, increasing. Okay, because it's going up. All right. Then after we figure out that it is increasing from f is increasing all the way to G. Then we saw we have to talk about if this is in the positive or negative area. So we saw that this separates the negative side for the Y value and this is for the positive side. So we would say that it is increasing on the negative side, right? Because it is below the x-axis. So we would say it is increasing right here and it is negative, right? Because you see how it's in the negative values. So it's negative increasing. It is negative increasing. So there you go, because we're talking about that value. So let's do one more problem here. It says, from the function f of x is graph, what is true about the graph over the interval from x is equal to negative infinity all the way to a, right? So negative infinity all the way to point a. I have this in paint so we can zoom in. So negative infinity to all the way to a. So this is where negative infinity was. Okay, it goes all the way here, it comes back up, it goes from here all the way up to A, right? So what was it doing? Well, it looks like it is increasing. So we would say here it is increasing, and it is increasing where? So again, we saw that this separates, the x-axis the x separates the negative side, which is on bottom, and the positive side, which is on top. So here we would say that this scenario, it is increasing and it is negative. So it is negative and it is increasing. So it is negative and it is increasing. Submit the answer. Good. New problem, right? This is a little bit more complicated. We're going from negative infinity all the way to A, right? So let's take a look at this one. So let's take a look, negative infinity starts all the way over here on the left hand side, negative infinity goes all the way to point A. So what is happening here? Well, looks like it's going down, all right? So it looks like it's decreasing, right? Going down and then we have to separate it on the x-axis and anything below here is going to be negative and anything above here is going to be positive. So here we would say this scenario it is decreasing in the positive area or you can say in the positive area it is decreasing. So in the positive area it is positive and it is decreasing. Hit submit, hit yes, there you go. So notice it is positive because it is above the x-axis, but it's going down, so it's decreasing, All right? So there you go. Those are everything that you need to know how to do when you do the increasing versus positive graph.